I got a complaint. Complaint is about my serverless video. Okay, this is a story. So few people reached out to me and said after they follow my serverless video, AWS built them. Actually, just following that video or if you just uh, uh, follow the video and deleted the uh, resource you created, you won't get built. Apparently what happens is you forgot to delete your resources. When I introducing AWS Freedia account in that video, I clearly mentioned you need to make sure so you know what you're using in this free tier account because this free tier account is not everything free unlimited, right? So when you go there, you can see what's free and what is not free. So when you create uh, RDS databases, those are not free for you, okay? So, but I have a happy news for you. And if you're doing this experiment in future, now they have introduced the free tier feature to the AWS RDS, I'll show you in a while. But today I'm going to show you how you can avoid this type of unwanted billing uh, in future right if it's already happened to you i'm so sorry but in future you can avoid this and if you are not used that or if you're not built yet and do this configuration you can so you can prevent the billing okay so you can go here go to your account and go to billing dashboard right and here you can find option called budgets okay here you can create your budget whether it's a monthly or how your budget should be right so you can go here and create but you can see here i have created a budget for like five dollar per month right and if you go here you can use a template right and you can say zero budget zero budget mean you need to stay within the free tier account right so if something is if you are using something non free tier it will uh, like uh, alarm you okay so monthly cost budget or daily saving plans or whatever so you can go to free tier or a monthly cost budget if it's a monthly cost budget it's asking like uh, uh how much you want to spend right and or if you go with the zero tier then they don't ask anything right so for my zero spend budget and then you can type your email address here uh, chris.com and then you can uh, create budget so once you create the budget like this so it will appear here and then when the budget exceeded you get email notification right so then you can come back and just delete whatever the resources you use which caused the billing okay so that way you can stay free tier or you can stay uh, within your uh, budget scope even you're using this commercially for your the business or some like consult uh, some serve your client then still you can set up a budget and then with budget exceed you can inform hey your budget is exceeding you need to take down some of your services or something like that okay it's a quick video so you can prevent additional billing if you want to stop there. But uh, if you need to know how you can create RDS databases without getting billed, so if you go to the RDS, when you're trying to create a cluster, now they have a new option called serverless. Sorry, three tier. So you can create here, go to uh, create database. So you can go with Postgres. And then you can see here, you have a free tier, right? So if you use the free tier, then I think you won't get billed. But that's what the free tier means. So that's it. Uh, see you in the next video. Until then, stay safe. Take care.